All right, so uh, what's your name? Where are you from? I'm Tom. I'm from Hall, Mass. Okay, I'm going to go to Texas. I'm going to go on a limb and say you're a Houston fan. I am indeed, yes. Okay, uh, are, so do you think the Patri Patriots cheated in any way about Deflategate? I think something happened. I don't think it really amounts to cheating compared to other things that happen in the league. So something happened. Okay, why do you think that Roger Goodell dragged the issue out so much? I think if it was just about uh, the deflation of footballs, then it never would have happened. But uh, he hired lawyers, and he destroyed his phone, and I think uh, Roger Goodell took that as an affront, and that's when he came down on him. You have anything else to add? Uh, I think that it wasn't worth a uh, penalty of four games, but I think there was a penalty uh, that was appropriate. They just didn't do it. They didn't do it right. All right, now are you a Patriots fan? I am, yes, sir. So what's your name? Where are you from? Brian Cahill from uh, Gloucester, Massachusetts. Okay, and uh, do you think that the Patriots cheated in any way or form in Deflategate? No, I do not. Okay. Uh, why do you think uh, Goodell dragged the issue out so much? Um, to tell you the truth, I think it was a lot to do with a previous scandal and um, how they were spying in the Super Bowl. And he kind of wanted to send a message with this to all the other owners that the Patriots, if they get caught with anything else, he's really going to throw the hammer down on them. And I think he did. I got you. Now, you have anything else to add? Um, Tom Brady's innocent. Okay. Thanks. All right. All right. So what's your name? Where are you from? I'm Dave Gomes. I'm from the north end of Boston. Uh, you might have seen me in the DraftKings commercials. Okay. And uh, are you a Patriots fan? Of course, since I've been since '96, when the Pats played uh, Green Bay and lost in the finals in the Super Bowl. And uh, do you think that the Patriots cheated? Uh, speaking of deflate game. No, not at all. There was no evidence to convict Tom Brady. What what they basically found, what the ruling was, was that Roger Goodell could do anything he wants as far as suspensions go. Uh, he was ruled innocent in court and they said well if Roger Goodell wants to give a suspension he can do basically whatever he wants to do and that's why Brady was suspended because that was the penalty that Goodell unfairly gave Tom Brady. And now uh, why do you think Goodell dragged this out so much? I mean Tom Brady's the if you look it up he's the number one hated player in the NFL I mean people tend to hate greatness he's probably the best player there is right now in the game greatest of all time and I think Roger Goodell's kind of in a tough situation with some of the suspensions he's made in the past. So basically, you just suspend the most hated player, you get some more fan support, some ownership support, and that's what basically why that suspension was given. It's too harsh, way too harsh. I mean, Ray Rice hit his wife and got two two week suspension. Tom Brady supposedly deflated footballs, and he got four weeks for that, which doesn't make any sense. It, they ran the ball anyway. It wasn't like... It was, it was a huge advantage, maybe with the fumble situation, but we didn't fumble. We don't fumble. We're too good to fumble. You got anything else to add? Uh, Roger Gale, Goodell should be fired. If not fired, there should be someone else helping him make decisions because the guy doesn't know what he's doing. With what he, I mean, the owners love him. He makes them a lot of money, but at the end of the day, money and it's kind of ruining. The, I mean, it's a money-driven league, but you just need to kind of make better decisions with your players and how everything works. Make, make equal decisions with everyone. Have a deal. Thanks. All right. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. What's your name again? All right. Just uh, say your name. Where are you from? Nick from Fall River. Billy from Fall River. Eric from Rainham. Are you guys Patriots fans? Of course. Absolutely. Yes, sir. All right. And uh, do you think that the Patriots cheated in any way or form about Deflategate? No. Not at all. Uh, I was at that game, and Tom Brady could have been throwing bars of soap, and they would have smashed the Colts. Absolutely not. Okay, and uh, why do you think Goodell dragged the issue out so much? I, I think to deface the Patriots. I, I think they've been such a, um, a strong franchise for so long, and I, I think other owners and other teams are jealous. Yeah, obviously Nick just hit the nail on the head. The Pats, they're the, the best franchise in the 2000s, and, and Roger Goodell is beside himself about that. So he's going after Tom Brady and the Patriots and Bill Belichick. Yeah, like uh, like they said, everybody hates teams who just keep on winning, and that's what we keep on doing, and uh, that that's why 
It's uh, I hate to be like a conspiracy talker, but that, that's basically what it is. Roger Goodell has uh, made it a point to uh, try to destruct the Patriots organization, and uh, he's doing the best he can, but I don't think he's going to be successful in the end. You guys have any, anything else to add? Oh, no. Yeah, uh, go Zolak. We love you, 98.5, baby. Woo! Go Patriots! All right, so what's your name? Where are you from? I'm Jared. I'm from Charlotte. All right. And now I'm going to guess you're a Patriots fan? Yeah, I grew up in Massachusetts. All right. And uh, do you think that the Patriots and Tom Brady cheated in any way uh, in terms of Deflategate? Uh, no, I think it's great gamesmanship, and I think they walked right up to the line as close as they could get. And uh, why do you think Roger Goodell uh, dragged the issue out so much? I think Roger Goodell dragged the issue out because I think he swept um, Spygate under the rug more so than the NFL owners wanted to be swept under the rug, and I think he's making up for lost time. And uh, you got any other anything else to add? Uh, go Pats. All right, thanks.